All right, everyone. This is Rambo145. We're going to play some uh, farming simulator. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this off what I had started at the beginning or at that live stream. Now we have a couple of tractors here. That's kind of newish. This one's kind of new. It's got the new fancy hoods, like 2016 supposedly. I don't know. Uh, then I just painted this one pink. You can get all these. The links will be in the description for everything, and so will the game where you can buy it and so on. The tra this trailer right here. And this truck, and this truck, you might have to pay a $5 membership on technicalmods.com, I think. I'll put it in the description. You guys can do that. Um, it's $5 a month, and you get then you can download any mods you want from their website. You just can't really share them because, you know, well, I guess you could as long as no one lets them out, but, I mean, people's going to let them out. That's the problem. You know, there's a collision right here, so I don't know if they updated this one or not. I haven't done that for a while. I haven't downloaded it. The hitch moves, I know that. I don't know about this one. We're going to hook the low boy up to this one. They have Jake brakes and stuff like that. They have windows. Let's see, does the windows actually go down? Yeah, they do. That's cool, man. Halfway down. Passenger door. door. There's the door. Driver's door. That's pretty cool. Let's uh, roll the window up. All right. Um, you got the Jake brake, which huh, they kind of have it coded wrong there. Same wheels white. I'm sure this is probably. I don't know if it's a work in progress or not. Not really sure about all this stuff. I don't really do too much. I never really use this too much, but we're going to use this. We're going to pull this big low boy. Oh, yeah, the hitch should move. I don't know. Oh, there's a hood. Okay, that's cool. Hood moves with the mouse controls. Look at that shiny chrome. Oh, my gosh. Look at that chrome, man. That's cool. Um... Should be a way to move the hitch. Not sure though. We'll see. Does the lights work? Do they go down with it? Oh, they do. Cool. Alright. Uh, should be a way to move the hitch though. Well, I thought there was. Maybe they didn't. Maybe they didn't do this truck like that. All right. Let's load this uh, pink cat challenger up on this one, and we'll load the. 2016 went up on the other trailer. Then we'll go up and we're gonna grab. Uh, well, actually, I need probably need to take the auger wagon. So I might. What I might do is just put an auger wagon on one of these trailers, and then I'll take it. I don't know. We'll see what we can get on here. Maybe I can back the auger trailer on this. Yeah, I might do that. We'll just do it that way. All right. Let's use this one. This one has all kinds of stuff on it. It's quiet inside. Yay. Hood comes up. Everything. I put these all on my website because I figured might as well. Everybody else is doing it. And plus, I can organize them that way. So I can just... Uh, when I... When something new comes out or something gets updated or... That'll be easier to find. Might have to see if I can pull this out farther. That way. Alright, let's try that. Not sure if those mods have errors or not. I didn't really look through them.
actually. We just haul all these. So let's just do that. <laughs> That's crazy, man. That is so... Good thing we on the, we're on the farm. Because I, I just broke off the lights. Oh, well. We're going to haul it like that. Or try to, at least. I'll probably play some multiplayer, but I wanted, I wanted to play multiplayer, but a lot of people don't have this stuff. Like this truck here, that truck. Yeah, so... <clears throat> so... Well, let's just see how this works. I don't know if it's going to work good or not. I could have hauled the trailer and then hauled the cat. That's what I was going to do in the first place, but whatever. I guess everybody decided to let the cats go now because since 2017 is going to ruin their fame. <laughs> I don't know. I think a lot of, like, a lot of it is, or whatever. Alright, so we're just gonna have to do it that way. There we go. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna work or not. Let's haul it. Let me drop the tag axle thing here. I think it's too low. Gonna lift it. There's a stupid hump right here. Oh. There we go. Had to raise it. Had to unlock it and lock it back. So. This is pretty cool. Truck kind of goes a little slow, but. Oh, well. We're going to take this up here, and then we're going to... I didn't get no uh, auger wagon, so... I mean, like, not auger wagon, but... Uh, Semi-trailer. Forgot to put that in here. Oh, wow. Well. Yeah, it's just a little slow. Of course, it's a lot of weight, though. We're pulling some, some total hardcore weight. Look at that. That chrome is like... That's kind of cool. Alright, so they're over there. We're just going to park this down here. Oh, they must be full over there. I have to get those hay bales too sometime. I was messing with, with uh, gooseneck trailers and stuff. I'm not real sure. I had to go through it and actually sit down and just pick it apart and do it right. But I just try to do stuff real quick and uh, see if I can get it to work with uh, the bell lock. Okay, so I got everything where it loads the logs or the hay up. But then when I disconnect it and connect it, it would fling my truck one way and the trailer would go fly another way. I was not sure what that was causing that. I spent a few hours messing with it because I've never messed with that stuff. And then I took and decided I'm just, if I'm going to do this, I'll just take it and pick it all apart. Do the trailer different. Just start from the ground up basically and just build it from scratch. With my, basically like take it apart and just put one part at a time in and just start getting it actually the right way instead of doing it the other, you know, doing it. Uh, oh wait, I forgot to unlock this thing. Instead of just trying to be quick and simple. Because a lot of times, you have a lot more problems doing it that way. Alright. So my auger trailer is about to fall off here. There we go. Oh, let's go empty him. Oh, let's, let's pick that ladder up. Let's go ahead and... The stairs. Let's fold it up. Close ladder... Let's see if that... Oh, I folded it back down. That's nice. I wasn't sure if I clicked it. There we go. Now it's folded. I wonder what the lights look like. Now, I wonder if you raise the hood. 
I wonder if their lights go up with it. Uh, helps to hit the button, right? The lights do not go up with it. Well, hmm. That's too bad. So 2017, they're going to have men and women workers. That's going to be awesome. All kinds of cool stuff. I don't know if it's going to be that way with... Uh, if it's actually going to be what I think it's going to be, but... It might be pretty cool. Like, you know, they said they're going to have milk and stuff. You can hold the milk now. You can, like, I guess, what, breed animals or something like that? That'd be kind of cool. Get more realistic. I wish the graphics would not duplicate 2013 or 14 or 15, whatever. I noticed the trees, though, if you look at, like, the trees compared to these trees, they're a lot different. Like, they're more uh, realistic. I'll have to do a screenshot here and there, and I'll see if I can find a picture of it, and we'll see if we can, if I can compare it, if I don't forget. Alright, so that's that. Alright. Let's go to this one. This truck here. This is the truck I mess with, so... They... I got it. And it had some problems. And I took and reworked it just a little bit. There's no errors in it. So, I mean, they might have took it and copied what I did. Which, that's more... In, that's fine with me. Don't bother me none. I mean, I ain't the first guy that thought of crap. So, all right. So let's go ahead and this is hitch moves. I did not realize that. That's pretty cool, isn't it? All right, let's fire this baby up. Let's go ahead and put the tracks back in just a little bit. It's pretty nice. I don't know, you might find some places where it's not painted right. Got a little bit of yellow there. I don't know if that's supposed to be pink or yellow, but it was kind of a pain getting it all right. Like that grate and stuff right there. Pretty sure, uh, that's supposed to be kind of black, but whatever. It works. Oh, this one's going to be too wide. Might have to go get the low boy. Yeah, things going to be too wide. Or not. We're going to park it right about there. That should be about balanced right on there. Alright, so let's go ahead and lock load. Lock it, and then we're going to fold the ramps. And then we're going to go. Let's go ahead and pull this thing. Oh, we can have strobe lights too. And then we have our Jake brake. You, hold your, you just hold your trigger down. And you push your left trigger, and it will actually use your brakes, but it doesn't show your brake lights coming on, and it actually slows your truck down, so it's kind of cool. But if you let off your gas, it does the Jake brake thing. We're not going to follow roads. This is a non-roaded area. We're making new roads. Which I should have followed the road, but I'm just so used to just cutting across. There's some... Sh Hey, there's some uh, corn there, there. Might try to get some people together, and we'll just do some plowing. Just big plowing. Just a big bunch of plowing. I'm not much of a team farmer kind of person, so if you guys play with me and I suck at something, like what I'm doing, that's because I don't, I'm not used to playing with everybody. What this? Oh, wait. That's dump suspension. What that? We want it to unlock the load. 
and then we're going to jump off and we're going to get this off of here now we're going to put these back so anyway that's that hopefully you guys enjoyed that that was like a 15 minute video a little after a little longer so I will talk to you guys later he's full again oh my gosh anyway there's a place on my website now just nothing but cat challengers and stuff you can go there and you can see what I have that's what's available that I can find that I know of and only mods you won't find me put up is the technical mods that you have to buy and that would be that one back there and this one and this trailer and a few others if I have them uh, and then if someone sends me mods to play with them like mowing mods if they have like a Ford truck you have to go to a forum and get them off of and fill the stuff out I won't put that up I won't even ask for permission because I don't care about putting it up there's already one place to get it but if they obviously don't want to share it with everybody that's their choice and that's why I look at it there's no point supporting that but uh, and then if uh, say stupid microphone and if I take in or someone sends me something to work on I will ask him if I can add it if after I fix it if I fix it and can fix it I'll ask him if I can put it up I won't take the mod and start putting it up I used to was starting to do that because a lot of kids want me to do that and like work on stuff and it was just taking too much out of my day like basically they didn't want to try first they just wanted to, me to do it and I still get that a lot but oh well that's always gonna be and uh so I will ask, so whatever rumors you have heard in the past and all kinds of stuff was never true. So anybody that's hating on me for that and thinking, oh, he just does stuff, it's not me, man. Uh, and then if someone takes something, so like if this cat right here, I put my name at the end of it. That's just for the paint, and I, I try to leave the credits. So if, if you guys do not put your name or the credits in the mod DOSC or DESC, and dust whatever that is mod description basically if you don't put your name in there I won't credit it in so if you got unless you have a big credit thing in a notepad then I'll put it in there but I don't know who did it and if you took someone's name out and then you uploaded this and that person was actually the original person that worked on it they're gonna get a little cranky look at my pink oil filter <laughs> and uh or fuel filter one too. Then they're gonna stop. They're gonna kind of a little be a little crabby about stuff. So anyway, I want to do some plowing. I'm gonna probably get a few people together, and we're just gonna do a whole big plow, hopefully, of nothing but cat challengers. And I'm gonna find a plow. I'll probably find it and I'll upload it on my website. We'll just do a big plow, you know. And then we'll just plow the fields just for the heck of it maybe do one field and see what we can do a lot of people can't get in my game for some reason I don't know if their connection is too slow or they have their settings to like secure maybe I think a lot of games you have to have it open like an open NAT and I mean it supposedly makes it unsafe but I mean a lot of Call of Duty games are requiring that if you don't have an open NAT or something like that you can't play you'll have all kinds of problems connecting getting kicked and all kinds of bull crap so anyway, thanks for watching. I will try to do that picture thing with the trees. Like if you look here, I don't know what my graphics are set on. Maybe they're not set up on the highest, but we're going to take a picture there. And I'll show you here. Let's just take a picture real quick. I'm just using my steam. All right, so there we go. And I will talk to you guys later. All these mods here that I just talked about through the thing will be in the description. And I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.